Scott will now demonstrate the one-handed tie with the right hand predominant. He will show you each throw one step at a time. Okay, so with our one-handed tie right hand predominant, we want to get back to our pincher grasp, as you see here. Okay, and it's just like the left. So scoop up, bring our left hand up towards it, make our little X, accept, release, come down, up, pause, let go, catch, and pull towards. Now I will demonstrate the second throw. Notice we're in the same position as when we tossed our first throw. So with our second one, we start with our right hand, karate chop, bring the left strand down, rest on the ring, pull, pull around, let go, grab, and pull away. Square knot. Scott will now demonstrate for you the one-handed tie with the right hand predominant. He will show you slowly one throw at a time. Go ahead, Scott. Okay, for our one-handed tie, right hand predominant, we always start with our pincher grasp, like so. The first step, just as with our left hand, is we want to take our index finger on the right hand, scoop up, then bring our white strand on our left hand over the top, like so. When we release the tension, grab that white strand with our index finger toward us. Then we want to grab the blue strand and sweep away, such. Then we want to let go and re-grasp and pull the blue strand towards us. Okay, now I'm going to show you the second throw on the right-handed uh, predominant one-hand tie. So we've left off from where we started with our first throw. We take our right hand, karate chop down. Then with our left hand, bring it across, lay it down on our right ring finger, sweep it up as such, bring it down, grasp, and pull.